One of the complications that we have when trying to extricate a patient is getting into the vehicle. Uh, we have to break out a window somewhere, which causes broken glass to be all over the inside. Now we have to crawl through that broken glass to get to the patient to cover them. Having the broken glass everywhere creates a problem for the safety workers because it cuts through our safety equipment and it creates a problem for the patient once we try to extricate the patient over the broken glass onto the backboard and out into uh, the ambulance. The nice thing about the glass keeper, it's a few easy steps. You take it out of your roll, you take off the backing, apply it to the window, break the glass and pull it off and you're done. You're in, it's clean and it's quick. The time that it takes to break a window and go in and cover the patient is a lot longer than being able to apply the glass keeper, break the glass and have direct access to the patient. It's a lot more expedient process and keeps us within that golden hour uh, that the patient needs to get to the hospital and hopefully save his life. Using the glass keeper to keep the broken glass out of the vehicle altogether creates a more safe environment for everyone involved. Hi, I'm here to introduce the glass keeper, which is a 20 by 30 piece of ad adhesive material which we use for extricating patients out of vehicles. Now the way this works is you align your glass keeper up with the B post, typically the squarest point of the window. Once it's aligned, you just press over it, adhere it to the window, break the glass, and then you roll the glass out of the frame and getting about roughly 95% of the glass out of here and not on your patient. Now you don't want to have any more overlap than necessary on the frame of the window because the adhesive on the glass keeper is tenacious. And if the more overlap you have on the frame, the more difficult it's going to be to pull the window out. The glass keeper comes packaged in a cardboard tube. The way you get it out is just open it up by unfolding the ends, pull on the red tabs, and the glass keeper comes out of the tube. Now then you size up your glass keeper to your window by seeing where the, red, the B post is and the red tabs at the bottom. Now once you have done that, remove some of the adhesive backing to get it started. And once you get it started, apply it to your window right at your B post there. Just line it up. You can pull off the rest of the adhesive Let it stick. Now you smooth it out, get your corners. Get your corners good because that's where you're going to want to get a lot of your glass and keep it from falling inside. Once you get the corners done, smooth out the center. And now you're ready to break the glass. But before you do that, you need to remember your personal protective equipment. Apply your gloves, goggles, and now we're ready to break the glass. I'm using a spring-loaded center punch. Just put it in the corner. Breaks the glass very quickly with one pop. Now when you're ready to pull this off, you're gonna notice this is a little bit difficult to pull off because I had to overlap here. But it will come off just as you pull the glass, pull it hard, and let it stick to the top. As it sticks up here, that's gonna be your hinge to wrap the glass up over the top and that gets it out of the way for your extrication purpose. Then you can sweep this off. And the window's clean.